Mulaney's gamble with Lenny Wilkins paid off. The Friars didn't need to take a big chance on the next important African-American recruit, John Thompson. Well, John Thompson, uh, see, I see him, he and Hadnot were linked together in the sense that they were, not only were they black players, they were six foot 10 black players. Six foot 10 black players back in the early 60s was like somebody maybe seven foot five today. They were true giants. John Thompson wound up here Primarily, I think John would tell you because his mama wanted him to go to a Catholic school. He had played in a Catholic school, he grew up in one, obviously. And uh, so his mother said, you know, you go look at uh, Catholic colleges. In 1984, Thompson would make history of his own, becoming the first black coach in college basketball to win a national title. John Thompson who went to Providence. He was a freshman when I was a senior. I got a ring once for Silver Anniversary Team. He presented it to me, 25 years out of college. 1961, there was 86, and it was the NCAA uh, finals. And he made a little speech and he said, you know, I'll never forget Johnny Egan, Providence College. I used to pull back my shade and look, and he'd be walking to church in the morning and it would be snowing out. And he said, I never forgot that. The addition of John Thompson during the 62-63 season set the stage for yet another run at a national title. Vinnie Ernst down court for the front. Providence defeated Miami and Marquette to earn its chance for the title. Nice play and little Vinnie gets the back. O'Connor underneath and misses. Thompson rebounds and it's three on one for Providence. Vinny Ernst gives to Jim Stone for the score. Over to Ray Quinn and Mr. Outside hits again. There's a close look at Ernst, a real mover. Over to Bob Kowaleski, Jim Stone. Stone is driving and watch the pass to Kowaleski for the basket. In the closing minutes of the final, their control tells the story. Kowaleski shot rims the basket, but Flynn rebounds, and he doesn't miss. 81 to 66, Providence College defeats Canisius in the NIT. Congratulations, Coach Mullaney.